A fire chief who helped recover the bodies of those killed in Thursday evening's car crash says it was a harrowing sight. When you're sitting there talking about seven bodies and then four of them burning the way they did and then having to actually remove the bodies from the vehicle, that, that does leave a lasting impression on you. Authorities say seven people were traveling west on NC 711 near Pembroke in an SUV when it went left of center, sideswiping a second car. Then the SUV crashed with a utility truck and ran off the road into a swamp before catching fire. Three people were ejected from the vehicle while four were stuck inside as the SUV caught fire. I've been in the emergency services for 20 years and by far this was the worst scene I have seen. The car that was sideswiped left the scene while the truck driver who was hit is expected to be okay. But only one of the victims who died in the SUV has been officially identified and state highway patrol says they haven't been able to reach their family. Meanwhile, other victims' remains are now being examined by the state medical examiner's office. This dessert factory confirms the seven who died worked here, hanging these seven bows behind me in their honor. Authorities say speed was a contributing factor. We get, tend to get to the point where we're always in a hurry. And it's, sometimes we just need to slow down and take things as they come. In Robson County, Monique John, ABC 11 Eyewitness News.